Are you mad at me? No, Hannah. Why would I be mad at you? I don't know, because you seem kind of mad. I pay all the bills in this house. Does that not give me, like, one night off from talking about you and your problems? Okay, wow. As it so happens, I'm not in the mood to talk about you. Okay, wow. I didn't even want to go into this right now, but you push me like you push everyone about everything. I push everyone? And why do you always wear my fucking clothes? Don't look at me like I just said something awful because I really didn't. I push everyone? You think we only talk about me? How can you fucking think that? Because we do. Seriously, Marnie, we only ever talk about you and it's always been that way, okay? First it's what's right with Charlie, then it's what's wrong with Charlie, then it's oh my god, I'm never gonna meet somebody. I, I, I mean, we have to wake up every morning and have a summit okay. just to make a game plan for you. You just flip this around in like a really crazy way. I am the one who has the right to be mad here. I am taking a really brave chance discussing my feelings. Why don't you bring it up when it's actually happening? That way we don't have to have these overwrought conversations. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Well, I do. Well, I don't. Well, now I need closure. You are so selfish. This is why you have no friends from preschool. I have friends from preschool, okay? I'm, I'm just not talking to them right now. You judge everyone, and yet you ask them not to judge you. That's only because nobody could ever hate me as much as I hate myself, okay? I, I mean, any horrible thought that you could have about me right now, I probably had like 30 minutes ago. That is bullshit. Because <laughs> I could literally think of a million things to say right now that have never once occurred to like you. Like what? I wouldn't do that. Name one. Seriously, say one. Honestly, Marty, you are so obsessed with success and who's who and what they have and how they got it. <laughs> Okay, like we were at that party last night with Tally Schifron, and I was like, oh my god, I bet she wishes that she was her best friend. So fucking transparent. Just so you could tell everyone to listen to your best friend on fresh air. I like being around people who know what they want. Oh, you mean people like you? <laughs> what do you want besides a boyfriend and a luxury rental? You know, you have always been this way, except now it's worse. I'm not worse. You are worse. You think that everyone in the world is out to humiliate you and you're like a big, ugly fucking wound. Adam says you are teetering on the brink of psychotic misery, but you are smiling so wide that nobody can see. You are the wound. I am not the wound. You are the wound. You are the wound. You are the wound. You are the wound. Stop saying that. I am not the wound. You are the wound. You know, it's probably pretty fucking simple. I have a boyfriend, and you don't. Oh, that's awesome. It's a really fucking mature way to deal with your feelings. I would back the fuck off if I were you. Yeah, like I am so scared. I mean, I probably should be, because you've been fucking batshit crazy since Charlie broke up with you. Yeah, well you've been crazy ever since middle school when you had to fucking masturbate eight times a day to stay off Wow. Fucking wow. That is an all-time fucking low. And I can't believe that you would say that. I told you that in the utmost confidence, and I told you never to tell. I didn't tell anyone. I'm just telling you now. I would never tell anyone because I am a good fucking friend. Well, maybe that's not my priority right now, okay? Maybe I have bigger concerns than being a good friend to you. Thank you. That's all I needed to hear. What is that supposed to mean? I can't live here anymore. Not with you. Well, I can't live with you either, okay? And I'm not just saying that because you just told me that you don't want to live with me. I was thinking, I don't want to live with her, but I wasn't going to say anything because I am a good friend. Fine. Great. Awesome. Rad.